likelihood of me, you know, dying like immediately, night two, is, you know, I could I could have failed four times by now, and they still wouldn't have missed anything. <laughs> so I guess I'll just start it then. Okay. Top is his uh, his subtitles. I probably should have had that at the bottom, but oh well. Interestingly enough, Freddy himself doesn't come off stage very often. Oh, whoops. I heard he becomes a lot more active in the dark, though. So. Oh, good. Yeah, y'all can still see that. I guess that's one more reason not to run out of power, right? Uh, I also want to emphasize the importance of using your door lights. Uh, there are blind spots in your camera views, and those blind spots have to be right outside oh, your door. Someone's out already. So if, if you can't find something or someone on your cameras, uh, be sure to check the door light. Uh, you might only have a few seconds to react. Not gonna, not gonna not lie, this is low-key creepy uh, I'm not implying that. when he's still talking uh, and you're just kind of seeing uh, things. Check on the curtain in Pirate Cove from time to time. The character in there seems unique in that he becomes Foxy. more active if the cameras remain off for long periods of time. Uh, I guess he doesn't like being watched. I don't know. Uh, anyway, I'm sure you have everything under control. Uh, talk to you soon. I don't even remember what I did last time. <laughs> okay. Oh god, okay. Uh Okay, okay. You stay over there. <laughs> you stay over there, Chica. How how long are you gonna Probably the duck. Or chicken. <sighs> Still just hanging out there? Okay. Here's my pre-roll, okay. Okay, good, that's just how I had it before. That's fine. Hey! Um, let's... God. Okay. Oh, I see, because of the cameras. Wow, that ate up all that power. It's 3 a.m. <laughs> there's, 
There's no way. Uh. I feel like this is moving way too slowly. Maybe I'm wrong. <laughs> oh no. My mom can't even get, I don't know what's happening, but she can't get her, um, what's that shot you get, uh, you have to get it before you do school, anything of school, a uh, TB shot, I think, and have it red, I had to do one too, uh, <laughs> and of course the company doesn't pay for it, it's like, no, no, you gotta pay $25 out of your own pocket, sorry, you know, <laughs> uh, and I don't think they even reimburse you, but she's been to like all these pharmacies. The, the pharmacy she she prefers and tries to stick, stick with now is is a is an independent local pharmacy because these big chain ones are just not doing it anymore. Well, they really haven't been doing it anyway because it's for your local businesses, but <laughs> uh. But so many people, I don't know if there's like an influx of people applying to be substitute teachers or what? Or to just be, you know, uh, temp staff workers in general? But I know the TB thing is literally, if you're going to be around kids, you got to take this kind of thing. So, it's standard. I didn't have to get another one done because I been in their system the last three years, so they're probably like, oh, yeah, it's fine, but anyway. Uh, <sighs> Apparently, there's, like, a big shortage in these poor pharmacists, man. They're, like, you know, and pharmacy techs, to, to any employee there. They have to tell these angry customers or, or patients or whatever, we're, we're out, we don't know why you, why they sent you to us, and it's just, it's just messy. You know, so, and Hope works at an independent place, and with all the vaccinations and everything, and the flu shots, and there only being a few of them that work there, because it's, like I said, it's an independent business, it's really rough, so, and it's, it's just a whole different thing, so guys, please, please be nice to your pharmacy, you know, pharmacist, pharmacist. The guy I work with said he walked into a major pharmacy chain to get a flu shot. They turned him away and said he needed to make an appointment. Yeah, that's th that's happening too. Uh, it's either, an but there was no one waiting, so he didn't understand why they wanted him to wait. Yeah, it's, it's like that, yeah. And, uh, this was, it's almost worse than when the, 
when COVID was still a spike. And it was, you know, of course worse then because everybody had to be extra protected and everything. And yeah, I'm just wait I'm just kinda chilling a little bit. Hope boss texted her. But finally uh had a semi decent week after her vacation last week. And then literally she can't even escape her boss, you know, when she's home, and she's like, I literally just got a text from my boss, and that ruined my whole weekend, so, you know, that's, that's how it is, and I was like, wow, what happened, but she didn't tell me yet, so, <laughs> how you been doing this for a boss, I haven't talked to you in ages, I've been seeing you report some fire, like, you have some fires in your area, in, you know, where you, where you live, like, Obviously not close to you, I don't think, because if it was, I would think, I'd hope that you'd be like, Oh god, we gotta get out of here, you know? <laughs> get, get, get the fam, get the pets and everything, and just be like, okay, we out. <laughs> so. The reason why I'm taking so long with this game is, this game is very... You had to be really in the moment and focused with this game. And that's what makes it so fun for viewers, because they get to see. And if the sound alerts work, I don't know yet. It'd be cool if it did. If it doesn't, maybe I can find a way to, like. I don't know. Be right. Let's try it. <laughs> of course, I knew it. It wor it works through my laptop, but not on here. Oh, oh shoot, sorry. Uh, luckily I have my thing muted. Um, yeah, pretty big fire fairy fairly close, but hopefully it won't spread into the city. Some people out in the uh, county might need to, or, or country, might need to evacuate tomorrow. Oh, God. So, have y'all been having a drought too? We, we, we've been kind of in a drought as well. The problem is with us is there's so much illness going around, so many different types. Yeah, it's very dry. Yeah, yeah it is. We were supposed to get some rain today, but apparently not. Uh, anyway. <laughs> I hate my phone update. I hate it. Ugh. I don't know if you have an iPhone or Samsung. Uh, I was going to pause it, but the iPhone update that I did for 12... Even though, of course, it's beyond 12 now. It's like 14 or whatever the fix is. It's so, like, very sensitive. You'll open a lot of things without meaning to, and then it'll be like, oh, we need your face. Well, I, I apparently Face ID has been a thing that people have been using, so that's not on it. That's on me adjusting. And it is convenient, I admit, but... Oh, okay. <laughs> Poor Hope. Hope's like, I'll tell you after the stream. It's it's a lot. LOL. Because I was like, what happened? My hell is she on about? <laughs> uh, uh, um. Oh god, I forgot what I was saying. Uh. Damn it. Well, in anyway. Uh. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We were talking about the weather. That's what we were talking about. I'm sorry. Yeah, uh... The weather has just been very weird. Like, it was... Cl it's cloudy today. It looks like it still is. And it looks like any rain we're getting is not yet. Not till Tuesday. Good lord. <laughs> well, that's fine. Yeah, 
sorry I haven't been keeping track, man. I apologize. <sighs> I... I don't know if... I don't think I updated Twitter much about it. But... I was... I was sick... Uh, last week. Negative for flu, negative for... COVID. But I had something. <laughs> so I had to, you know, I think I started getting sick... Tuesday? Last Tuesday? Yeah, something like that. Yeah, yeah, because I went back to work Wednesday. And it was so annoying, because it's like, well, gee, that's convenient. You know, like, <laughs> literally the day before I... Because I had a week off, too, because... Um, Hope and I never got our, you know, week-long vacation in Canada like we wanted. I mean, I mean, it's it technically still wasn't quite fulfilled because it wasn't everybody, but... Our, our D&D group, I mean, but... It was more like, ah, oh, you know what, like, we'll be all at the same time, we'll hang out if we want to hang out. If not, we'll just go chill and do whatever, you know. So, hey, you know, it's been great, but problem is... The last outing I was doing of Hope, I suddenly got really sick, and we were doing an escape room, and it was kind of like, oh god, like, are, are we up to, because, I don't know if you ever done an escape room before, Ozzy or Boston, but they're very, yeah, with reservations, like, they won't, you have it, oh, you love it, man, it's, they're awesome, just make sure you have someone else in with you, Hope and I have been doing it on our own for, like, a long time. Keep in mind, I. <laughs> it, it all depends on how, uh. You find out very quickly what your strong assets and what your weak assets are in it. So. <laughs> Example, uh, for me, I overthink. All the time. I can't stop it. All the time. That's a problem. Uh, with Hope, I think it was basically, you're too confident, like, you gotta not be so stu- you know, like, you gotta kind of pull back a bit. So, I mean, it just kind of shows, you know, the basic key rule, you know, key is moderation, but, you know, we put our two heads together, it works, but usually Hope, well, pretty much always, Hope is like the brains, and I'm just kind of the wanderer, like, agreeer, or- Oh, I noticed this, you know, and this was probably the first game where I actually kind of felt useful, you know? <laughs> like, I would see hints before they were hints and not even think about it. And I was like, ah, is so that was a thing. I'm shocked. Uh, well, you basically go into a room, uh, usually it's two to eight people. Uh, for like an hour? Hour and a half, something like that? And whatever the theme of the room is, you know, it's what you're doing. So you're solving puzzles, you're like, you mess up a lot of locks, a lot of different locks. And you have a timer going, and you have, like, hints from the Game Master, which will appear on a screen or through an intercom or something. And you have a certain amount, and since they're, like, kind of their own thing, they're not exactly chain places. I mean, they kind of are, I guess, but the, that's the reason why... They don't like people canceling, and they don't give their money back, because they're basically staying open for you. You know, for you to do it. So, it's probably a very... <laughs> Poor Hope was like, I mean, I could send you a screenshot of, of, the, of the stuff that happened, but you'll need uh, context. You know, her and her boss, and I was like, yeah, yeah, go for it. <laughs> you know? Anyway, um, it's, I'm not gonna lie, escape rooms can be stressful, because you can drive each other crazy if you're not careful. Because, you know, you might get stuck on something, like, why does that not work? Or there's actually a literal lock puzzle you're doing, and it'll be like, why is this not working? Like, literally, my math is correct and everything, and it turns out it's not the person. It's 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 the, the game master messed it up. They they forgot to reset it. You know what I'm saying? So then they give you some leeway, like, hey, you know, that was our fault. You know, kind of thing. And technically, Hope and I uh, solved the, the the thing. Well, or Hope solved it. I don't know. We we're basically a team, I think. As always, I'm just not the brains as much. We had the code. It's just, for some reason, the thing didn't 
work like it was supposed to. So we had like three minutes to spare and we were able to come out of it like, yay! And you know, I mean, the whole point is the experience. And I was like, oh, I literally just been chatting it up with chat. <laughs> I was like, okay, 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 fine. Yeah, who's got me there? basically like, I'm gonna need you engaged. And I was like, oh, yeah, that makes sense. Because even though I'm chatting up and stuff, it's still, it won't be that much of a fun stream if I'm literally just sitting here talking all the time. Although there are streamers who do this, they just chat. And they get like a million people, and I'm like, what on earth are you guys chatting about exactly? And I mean like the regular, like people. I don't mean like the, the people where you're like, oh, we're having a hot tub stream, or we're doing something sexy if you throw this many bits in, or something. Oh. Oh, damn, the fire situation. The fire crew remake closest to the fire is going to be patrolling tonight to see if they need to back anyone. <sighs> Ooh. Then the volunteer department near me will be doing the same tomorrow. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, We're literally getting paid to stay alive until 60 doesn't do that, so. I'm gonna try this bit. Uh, okay. Wrong place. Okay. Foxy. I think that's all the villains, I think. Characters. See, my problem is, is I've seen so many YouTubers. Well, I've really only seen one YouTuber that. Watch a few. Dolls or animatronics. I'm just kind of going by sound at this point. Okay, kitchen noises. course you really should check Pirate Cove a lot. <gasps> oh god. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Come on, 4 a.m. Come on. I still gotta get to 6 a.m. Oh my god. I'm, I'm doomed. <laughs> doomed as doomed can be, you know?
okay. <laughs> he gave me a good scare that time. Okay. Because, <laughs> you know, disorient shit. Like, ah, oh, what the heck was that? You know. Do I want to see an early screening of Disney's Wish? Uh. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, God. No. No. Not like this, bro. Okay, I was like, bro, I'd actually like to, you know, <laughs> die the regular way and not just run out of power because I'm because I'm stupid about serving it. But once I heard that 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 uh, clacking, I was like, hey. But I knew it would mess up my schedule, and I'll keep on going, and I'm gonna try. Waiting around, waiting off the clock. Just like real life. And I have freaking animatronics coming at me. Oh, there it goes again. Oh my god. Why is this a. Does this happen at like 2 a.m. or something? I'm gonna have to get around that somehow, because now I'm stuck. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm gonna guess. Um. Maybe it's like. Like, uh, 2 a.m. where things get really crazy? I forget. I don't know. <laughs> Only the second night, though. Just looked it up. Oh, okay. Oh, door jamming means you screwed up and let one of them infiltrate the guard room. Oh god. That's a little unsettling to know, okay. runs like power like this like this is a little ridiculous like it doesn't even make any sense how could one power so much like that I mean I guess it makes kind of sense I don't know <sighs> yeah I know we see you Freddy They gotta top up on minutes, yeah, really. Okay. Nope. Don't do it, Foxy. Don't do it. 
Oh yeah, and Foxy home sometimes. You're dead, dum 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 dum. Yeah, do people these days even understand the concept of buying more phone minutes? That's a good question. Okay, why is it all itchy? Okay. I'm kind of amazed they still use them. I feel like... But you know what, though? I feel like they still go through them a lot because that data, you know, everything's like online these days, so it's like, oh, yeah, if you want to check your Twitter and stuff more, make a TikTok, you need data, and it's like, oh, God, no, I need minutes, or whatever you call this. by myself. Who knows? Maybe I'll get kind of desynthesized to it. We'll get jumped. Oh, shoot. At first I was like, oh, look at how well I'm doing. Then I realized the doors were closed. Top for the subtitles. That's where they put it for some reason. Hello, hello. Hey, you're doing great. Uh, most people don't last this long. <laughs> I mean, you know, they usually move on to other things by now. Uh, I'm not implying that they died. That, that, that's not what I meant. Uh, anyway, I, I better not take up too much of your time. Uh, things start getting real tonight. Uh, oh, really? Hey, listen, I, I had an idea. If you happen to get caught and want to avoid getting stuck into a Freddy suit, uh, try playing dead. You know, no limp. Then there's a chance that uh, maybe they'll think that you're an empty costume instead. Then again, if they think you're an empty costume, they might try to stuff a metal skeleton into you. I wonder how that would work. Yeah, never mind. How? Scratch that. It's best just not to get caught. Um, uh, okay, I'll, I'll leave you to it. See you on the flip side. <laughs> yeah, everybody's out. It's about to get real tonight, man. Yeah, 
power consumption makes a significant difference. cheat to do it, but <laughs> whatever. <laughs> it's better content, okay? <laughs> nights you're fine, but it's definitely going down faster. Oh my god. Did you see that power drop? Oh my good lord. Close that door again. Yeah! Oh boy. He's gonna call us now.
Hey Chica. Get back to your spaces, guys. I know we don't pay you and all that, but you're supposed to, you're not supposed to be real. it out. I only have 15% left. supposed to be way worse and way harder I don't know if my knights are still quick or not I have no idea Oh, 
I did not mean to get out of the camera. I did that automatically. Yeah, I think this is why. That they're more aggressive. Sure. They're like all over me tonight. <laughs> Time, look at that. right there trophies disappear that side ah damn it yeah <laughs> yeah very very taxing J just for the heck of it i i did buy the second game for thinking oh if i if we can't stand it more we, we can just hop to the second game or whatever but it turns out i actually beat it because i don't know if the custom night tending and of course, as you can see, the ending's not really worth it, like, at all, but... In the second one, they start delving more into the lore and stuff. Where you actually have to do, like, uh... Like, find Easter eggs. And literally, you have to do, like, the, the most... Uh, I'm trying to think of a game to compare it to. Those MS-DOS games, way back, like the Atari days. You had to play these little mini games to tell more of the story and you know unlock more stuff and some of it was like you know pretty obvious like oh okay you just do this and then there are other things where it's like wow that's a lot of <laughs> you know and if you messed up you have to play through the nights again and everything so i don't know about all that but <laughs> you know Maybe next time to mix it up. Or Emily wants to play next time. <laughs> I can guarantee you that one would be a lot shorter. <laughs> you know, because... There aren't really... Because I think with... Some of the FNAF games, I think some of them really are by chance. And some... You know, it actually 
does take skill and strategy, and I think the first one was literally chance. The only reason I did better is because the nights were longer, so my battery power wasn't depleting nearly as quickly. Now it's kind of annoying because I feel like faster nights would have meant, or fast nights would have just meant like, uh, you start at 2 a.m. instead, and then you, you know, all this stuff, but... Uh, but essentially it was the same, it was just a little longer, I don't know how much longer, and your battery... I did notice, though, in the last two hours of the, you know, shift, so to speak, uh, the flashlight percentage would drop down like 5% out of nowhere, and it's like, what the heck was that? And it's just like, oh, it's because it's near end game, or... Yeah, those doors closed too long and all that. Oh, well, sorry if it wasn't a very good, but but hey, you know, I'm trying to delve into new territory here. <laughs> At least for me, anyway. But hey, it's good to be back on the on on here again with you all. And It'll get better. I, I I don't know. I just I just wanted to do something different while the iron was hot. There's actually another game I need to still do for a friend of mine called Whitestone, I think it's called. He was so nice, he gave me like the free code for it, where I was able to download it on here for free. On my console. Just even more rare. That's usually Yeah, remember, don't get a metal skeleton stuffed in you. Yeah, exactly. Or trust anything that says we're not responsible for death, and it's like, uh, okay. Or, you know, uh, oh, usually people don't make it this long, and it's like, not that I mean that they die, it just, you know, that sounds kind of bad. And the last thing I'm going to say before I end the stream, because it is almost 10.30, is, uh, the first night, the, the phone guy, you know, before he, whatever happened to him happens, he did say, like, I gotta, you know, read this thing of these things, so you think you're, they're basic NDA, or, you know, you have to agree to these conditions, you know, just like any other job. And it sounds pretty, you know, basic, like, blah, 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 blah. And he's like, blah, 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 and he suddenly says, they are not responsible for any death or dismemberment or anything. The carpets shall be cleaned immediately. Do not do so till we're ready. And <laughs> and it's kind of like, wait, wait, what? And then he's like, okay, okay, that might sound bad, I know, but you know, it's okay, it's fine. I, yeah, you know, the guy was kind of complaining that people were, you know, they were trying to get to his office, which basically what they were trying to do to me. I mean, obviously. So, you know, we put him on the day shift. <laughs> and then... <laughs> <coughs> or I'm, like, replacing the very dude that, like, was like, I can't do this anymore, man. And it's like, no, we gotta make our money, even though there really shouldn't be security for this kind of thing. But what do I know? Anyways, <laughs> I hope y'all enjoyed it. Uh, I think I will upload some of it on YouTube, I guess, just to have it, like, new content, but there's gonna be a lot of editing. <laughs> but I'm gonna make sure to try to keep the good stuff in and not, like, just, I don't know, I'll figure something out, but anyway. So, works out for the night, so bye-bye, guys. Bye-bye.